Welcome to Fave. Here's what you need to know to get started with Fave Pay and Fave Biz. Once you're onboarded on Fave, new customers will be able to find you on the app. They can also discover you through the Fave decal at your outlet. Using Fave Pay is easy. Once the customer is ready to pay, just show them their total bill amount on the receipt. They can then scan the QR code displayed next to your payment terminal. and a payment page will appear. On this page, the customer can key in their total bill amount. Input any promo code, enter their payment method, and click Pay. Ask customer to show the successful payment page for confirmation. Then, select the Fave Pay payment method on your POS system to print out their receipt. That's it! The transaction is complete. Both you and the customer will receive a notification for successful payment. Now that you know how Faith Pay works, here are 4 steps you need to take to get started. Step 1. Set up your POS system to accept Faith Pay payments. These should be recorded as credit payments. Step 2. Set up your POSM. Make sure that the wobblers and the QR code are displayed next to your payment terminal and put up the FavePay window decals at the entrance for better visibility. Step 3. Use the FavePay's staff guide included in your starter pack to brief your wait staff to ensure a smooth transaction process. Step 4. Log in to your FavePay's account to view all details related to your feature on Fave. Or, you can also download FavePay's app from the App Store and log in to your account there. Key in your partner code as provided by your FavePay partner manager to log in. On the FavePay's app, you can switch the language from English to Malay or Chinese. You can view all your real-time transactions from the app and filter according to dates. Notification for each transaction will include customer's name and the total amount paid. There are four ways you can be notified. To enable this, make sure that your phone is set to allow notifications from the app. First is by a push notification from FaveBiz. Second is by email. Third is by SMS. And fourth is by checking on the FaveBiz app. To cancel a transaction, first choose the transaction affected, then click Cancel Transaction. After the transaction is cancelled, you'll be able to refund the customer. You'll receive an email confirming that the transaction has been cancelled. You can also view a more detailed report of your business transactions and revenue trends on Fave. To view your reports, click on Get Reports, select your platforms and choose your date range. Then, key in your email address. You'll then receive the reports via attachments in your email. These reports will also be helpful when you need to make payment reconciliations. If you have further inquiries, reach out to the FavePay team in your respective country. Have a great feature with Fave!